What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Dead on Day Productions with another special... Oh, that's a badass picture. Uh, a special <laughs> little event. If you've been paying attention, you've seen I have started a new show called Five Random Questions, where I'm just calling up mofos on my Skype directory. So that means you need to make sure that you're adding me. David Vancura, D-A-V-I-D-V-A-N-C-U-R-A on Skype, because you never know when I'm going to get the urge to just call some people. And today, I've got a longtime viewer who's been with me for a long time here on Dead on Day Productions, and that is Mr. Supreme. What's going <laughs> on, my man? Not too much, not too much. Awesome. Excited to be on the show. I'm excited to have you here, brother. So let's, uh, let's not gild the lily too much. Let's get right into it. You ready to play five questions? Mm -hmm. All right. Remember, once Let's you start, it. you have to answer all five. No exceptions. <laughs> or else. All right. Here we go. First question. Who is the most overrated and underrated wrestlers of all time? One of each. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah. um, Coming out hard. Overrated? Uh, I'm going to have to say John Cena. I know he's put in. I know he's put in a lot of good work. A lot of good work in the WWE. But, I mean... It's kind. Of, this is probably a popular uh, answer for a lot of people, but I don't personally think age, he. Yeah, people my age, maybe, yeah. But kids, <laughs> you might get egged now. Your house is getting egged, buddy. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> I know there's a lot of Cena fans here in Richmond. Whenever Raw comes here. Yep. Um, yeah, he's put in a lot of good work in the WWE. He's a good worker, but just because you show up doesn't mean that you're awesome. Um, you have to go above and beyond. And he, he has, but in recent times, I don't think he's deserved all the titles he's gotten. And then, underrated, I'm going to have to go with Mr. Perfect. Like you said on your show, he's one of my favorite wrestlers, too. Yeah, it's hard to um, go against the perfect one. Yeah. I mean, there's not much to be said unless you, if you watch his uh, matches and yeah, Kurt go Henning back in WCW. Yeah, there's no question. Kurt, Kurt Henning really does sell himself. He's so fantastic mm -hmm. and... I agree. I agree with you. That's a good answer. Yeah, he's a marvel. Yeah, he is. Well, you know what? He's simply perfect. Not, not, <laughs> there's nothing not more to say. Nothing more to say exactly. on that, man. All right. Ready for question two? Mm -hmm. Here we go. If you got a free $100 right now and you had to spend the day, spend it today, what are you buying? Hello? Sorry. Sorry. I had to do something real quick. Um... <laughs> I just spend a hundred dollars. Someone just walks up, says, "Here's a hundred bucks, but you gotta spend it today." What are you buying? Um, honestly, I, I mean, it sounds kind of like cheesier, but I'd probably donate it to Joe Cronin and oh, the wow. show. Wow. Yeah, it's not a whole lot well, that I need not right now. Why donate so. it to Dead on Dave Productions? I need money too. Do you, 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 do you, you have an online tip jar? <laughs> well, no, but you could just say, "Hey, uh, I want to give you money, and I'll just give him my PayPal." Oh, yeah. Split it 50-50. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, I like that answer. I like that answer. Okay. <laughs> Number three, what is the craziest thing about you that nobody knows? Um, yeah. I'm really good at going on long, angry rants, mm -hmm. but I have a lot of self-control, mm -hmm. so... I've never, like, funneled it before, but that might be something I do on YouTube. Mm. It's kind of overrated and hard to get a following from just doing that nowadays because it was a big thing in, like, 2009 through yeah. 2011. But um, I might go on rants about, like, you, YouTube and wrestling and just, like, TV shows and video games and stuff like that. So, yeah, probably my best gift is just, like, making something good out of a... Uh, Getting really angry all the time. <laughs> so, so the, the secret is that Mr. Supreme is full of rage. I like exactly. That. I like that. All right. So Genie pops up. This is question four. And he says, I will give you free tickets to the Super Bowl or free tickets to WrestleMania or $10,000 cash. But the caveat is you cannot attend either or hmm. any other live event for one year. What do you choose? Um... Depends on, I mean, WrestleMania over the Super Bowl, but it depends on how WrestleMania is going to go. 
since it's up in the air, I'd probably take the 10,000 and go another year. Oh, you can't, to be completely you can't honest. go to any other live event. You can't go to the Super Bowl or live event. You cannot use that money. To, Ever? To, yep, for, for the next year, one year. Hmm. Yep. WrestleMania, then. Are you going to pick Mania? Wow, that's awesome. Mm-hmm. True wrestling fan. I like that. Yeah. And the fifth and final question, what is your biggest dream WrestleMania matches? You can pick multiple. Um, Is there a limit? We'll limit at five. Okay. Uh, so like a card, kind of. Um, yeah, basically. CM Punk and Stone Cold would be really good. Yeah. Uh, I kind of want to see CM Punk and um, Mr. Perfect. Oh, yeah. That'd be a good match. That would be um, a good match. I want to see... I want to see... Um, oh, man, I forgot his name. Dean Malenko. Ooh, I'm trying man to think of... Thousand of holds, yeah. Yeah, I'd want to see... Either him and Rey Mysterio do one more match. No, I want to do... Or I want to see him and Sami Zayn have a match at oh, WrestleMania. I, you know, I'd pay good money to see Dean Malenko and uh, Daniel Bryan. Could you, mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Yeah, because they have Ugh. the same stature and everything. Oh, my God. That would be incredible. Mm-hmm. But I'm with you on the Sami Zayn match. That's a good match, too. But please continue. Yeah. Uh, what else? I mean... Hmm, I haven't thought about wrestling too much as of late because I've tried to back away from it. But uh, I wouldn't have called. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> uh... I think I'm just going to go with those three. Sorry, it's kind of a no, no, lackluster no, answer. No, no, great answer. No no lackluster answers here on five questions. I asked five <laughs> questions. You answered five questions. Fantastic job. Is there anything you'd like to plug Why I got you here? Any channels, anything that you're doing that you want the people out there to know about? Um, If anyone's into gaming, a really good channel to check out is uh, Corpse A Lot. He's pretty underrated in the YouTube community. And... Uh, Everyone should keep supporting the Joe Cronin community, and uh, that's about it. I agree. I agree. Thank you for joining me real quick, my friend. That was awesome. Uh, first time on the Dead on Dave Productions. Hope it was a good one. Mm-hmm. It sure was. All right, Hope buddy. to be on again. Awesome, awesome. You will be. I promise you that. Thank you, everyone, for joining us right here on Dead on Dave Productions. And remember, keep your Skype open because you never know when you're going to get five random questions of your own. Peace.